guys, it's Katie, and welcome back to my channel. And if you've never seen this channel before, it is all about volleyball. And uh, on my last video, um, I got a comment that I should do like a little story time about one of my experiences with volleyball. So that's what we're going to do today. We're going to have a little bit of a story time. So let's get started. Alright, so the story slash experience that I'm kind of going to be telling today is about the time, it was this year during school volleyball, uh, I completely surprised myself. So I've never been a great hitter. I've played for a club this year, I played right side hitter, but besides that, I've always been a setter. And I love setting. It is it is my favorite position in volleyball because you can do a lot with it, I think. Um, but anyways, so, you know, in practice, we don't just practice our own positions. Uh, we practiced all the other different skills, so that was really good for the whole team. Um, so, I never was able to get my hits really good in practice, like, I would either hit them into the net, or I'd, like, I don't know, hit it weird, so it would go, like, off the court somewhere, but it would just never be a good hit. So, you know, I, I kept working at it, like I usually do with anything else, um, and... So, it's one of our, I think, mid-season games, and it's a home game, so, you know, it's kind of our turf, you know, you want to win, um, but sometimes you don't, but that's okay. So, we're on the second half of, like, the whole game. So, it's after we switch sides, you know, I went in to sub for someone else on my team just because they twisted their ankle pretty badly and you know I know how that feels because this school year is when I injured my left ankle really really badly so I kind of felt her you know I was like my ankle's feeling good today I'm all for playing let's go so and it was that day that my coach decided that I should try out being a hitter because sometimes she'd tr switch around our positions, which we were all for. I mean, I was a little bit nervous since I'd never been hitter before, and I was just worried that I was going to screw up. And yeah, I did a couple of hits where they weren't the best, but we were still able to play it off from the other team. So yeah. But anyways, switching sides, I went in uh, as I believe an outside hitter. Um, but I was in the middle position front middle or middle front um so but I was still outside hitter and for some reason my coach never taught us how we should transition or at least didn't teach me because I was prepared to be a setter so I didn't really memorize that rotation so I completely forgot but and that's my bad but um I they got it up they were hitting it. No, yeah. They hit it up with a bump, so it was a free ball. I was up. I had a feeling that I was gonna that I got it. I did my approach. Everything was good, and then I completely like I did the best kill I've ever done, and we got an ace off of it, like an ace type thing where they didn't get it at all. Like, the whole team dove. So that was kind of cool to see. And I, it was so quick. I didn't even know what happened afterwards. And so we get the point. And this one, and right after that, we took a timeout. So uh, my team just, like, hugs me and hugs me. And my coach, like, high fives me. And I was like, wait, what happened here? And... The team was just like, you just scored at the point by a hit. And I was like, oh my god, that was great. I kind of remember now. And it was 
it was just such a great experience. It kind of boosted my confidence up a little bit because I'd never been very confident in my hits, like I said before. So, I mean, yeah, I was super, super nervous because I thought that I did something wrong. Like, that's not my position. I, I thought that I messed it up. But when they told me that we, like, actually got a point off of it because I just totally blanked out after that. I was, like, in shock. So when they told me that we got a point off of it, I was just super, super excited. And, you know, even though it's out of the season any now, like, I was a TA for my coach in her class. So we always talk volleyball stuff. Like, I love talking to her. She's one of my best friends, honestly, like, teacher-wise. So, and I'll talk to my teammate, or my old teammates about it. And it's just, it was a great time. It was a great day. I was so, so proud of myself because I did something that I had never done before, and I wasn't confident in. So, I guess the story kind of has a moral to it. It's like, don't give up. Keep trying. Like, and one time, you will succeed at it, whether you really remember it or not so uh yeah just keep trying guys i mean if whatever position you guys play like just go for it and if your coach switches things on you like my coach did to me that one game like just still believe in yourself because i know that i didn't and yet i like me and my team came out strong that day that was one of the first days that we won both games and that was it was great for us we were so so proud of ourselves and really it was because we stuck together as a team because volleyball really is a team sport you know you need to be able to work together and we really did that well that day we encouraged each other and you know we we said you know shake it off when we messed up or you know that was that was great when we did things good so, yeah, you guys just don't give up. Keep trying. Practice at home. Practice in the gym. You know, just keep working at those skills and you will succeed at it. So, but yeah, that was kind of my little story time today. It wasn't the longest thing ever, but it was about almost 10 minutes. It's almost 8 on here. But, um, yeah, I hope you guys liked this video. Please comment down below what you thought of this and also please comment and give me ideas for future videos uh like this video if you liked it i mean i hope that you guys liked it um and also please subscribe that'd be pretty cool i'm gonna have more videos out soon i'm not really sure i don't know or i don't really have a schedule for when i'm gonna be posting videos so just kind of be prepared for that keep looking for new ones uh so yeah Thank you guys for watching. Thank you if you have commented, like giving me support or giving me ideas. It's honestly actually helped me because I've been really nervous about this. So, yeah. Bye.